facing sideways. This is a band that really does march to its own drummer. Well, they certainly do. Well, literally, I suppose, but, but, they, they, but do. they really do. Well, they, they do march to their own drummer. They don't use anyone else's drummer. <laughs> Here we go. Hegeman String Band, The Codfather, the sequel, and Captain John Barrett.
well. Innovative again. Hageman, again, Captain really, John Barron. They really are. Uh, first of all, the, the captain was not on the sh in the show at all for the last 20 seconds. He was only on the video board. As, as he was captured he, in the net. As he captured in the net. So no one's ever tried that before. He started out as a lionfish and then became the codfather. There was only one minute of fish music, and then after that, all the music was 1920s. Well, it's interesting. The storyline is a guy goes and he's fishing and drops the line in, and then you go underwater, and I think they did a great job with the music at the beginning and making it sound like it was underwater. Yeah. And as if you were in a school of fish and moving about, right. and then you start to see that there's this mob part underwater, and at the end, what transpires is that the guy who was fishing, his net, and it turns out the guy who was fishing was a law enforcement yeah. officer, caught the mob fun. Does that right. make sense? <laughs> yeah, well... <laughs> I mean, Hageman does things that are so unusual. You know, when they did that, that Beatles theme a few years back when they went from black and white to color, then they had the wonderful TV backdrop with the, the home, uh, whatever they call it, the household havoc. And then last year, with a light show with uh, the immortal utopia, no band is as creative as Hageman. That's for certain. Whether they win, who knows? But they are a very creative thing. All right. Well, more of the 2016 Sugar House Casino Mummers Parade yet to come. And I see Jane Barron out there. Good to see Jane. Hey, John. Good job.